it was two years ago when Roanoke City celebrated the opening of Earth Fair, a high-end grocery store in South Roanoke that many considered a big get for the area. But today, the company announced it's shutting down all 50 of its stores, including the one in the Star City. 10 News reporter Shane Dwyer is live tonight outside of the store. And Shane, how long will it be until the doors shut for good? Well, Brittany and John, the employees that we talked to today say they were told to be prepared to close this store here by the end of the month. But if you take a peek at the doors and the windows here at Earth Fair, there's really no sign of anything other than just business as usual. Shoppers we talked to today were, of course, disappointed to see one of their stores closing. But the city folks, on the other hand, they are keeping a very close eye on this property, and they're hoping that the developer is able to turn it over sooner rather than later. The days for shoppers at Roanoke's Earth Fair supermarket are now numbered. The company announcing Monday it doesn't have the cash to keep going and all 50 stores are closing, much to local shoppers' dismay. It really wasn't our fault, but it is sad for the community, I think, because, you know, we get good things here and for whatever reason, you know, they don't last long. That's one thing Roanoke City Economic Development Director Rob Ledger wants people to remember. He says the Roanoke store was a top performer. An Earth Fair manager who didn't want to go on camera said Roanoke was actually in the top three. But either way, a closure just two years after it opened to much fanfare still stings. It is a little bit bitter and disappointing that after this uh, short period of time, the company has decided to liquidate. The Ivy Market Shopping Center here along Franklin Road had just hit full occupancy, but this isn't the first grocer to close here. Ucrops built a two-story grocery castle only to close soon after. The space sat empty for years before Carillion moved in, but Ledger expects something different this time. It's a ding, but it seems like the economy is, is booming still, so uh, we don't anticipate it being empty for a long time. The city is expecting a new grocer or retail operation to move in soon, although they don't know anything for sure. 50 people are out of jobs with closure of Earth Fair, but shoppers are hoping they can get new jobs possibly even in the same building. It's sad for the people who work here. Hope that, you know, there's more good job opportunities for them that will open up and hoping maybe we get a Trader Joe's. <laughs> Earth Fair says that there will be major markdowns for its liquidation sale. As you heard there, shoppers and people here in Roanoke in general have been begging almost for a Trader Joe's or a Whole Foods to come to the area for a long time now. We be reached out to both of those corporate offices and we, they were had any interest in coming to Roanoke and we did not hear anything from back from them this evening. Live in Roanoke, Shane Dwyer, 10 News, working for you.